It's not a very big city. It's only a population of uh, 600,000 people. So you can literally walk around it within a day. Like always, I love riding through city parks. And this one is uh, one of the nicer ones, uh, especially there's a river running uh, alongside it. Beautiful. Got plenty of seating areas to uh, rest and relax and uh, soak in the atmosphere or the lack of atmosphere and just to enjoy nature itself while being in a city. So I'm at the Cathedral Basilica of Vilnius and uh, this is the main cathedral of the Catholic Church in Lithuania. They sure do have a lot of money to put this up, don't they? And it was opened in, uh, I think, around 1783. We're in the late 1700s at least, but as you can see, it's pretty nice. So directly behind the Cathedral uh, Basilica in uh, Vilnius is the Castle Tower. Uh, built rough, I think around 1409. It sits and preaches on top of a hill. As you can see, there's not really much left of uh, the castle itself. But they have partly restored a little bit of it. St. Anne's Church is a Roman Catholic church in the old town of Vilnius. It's a prominent example of both flamboyant Gothic and uh, Greek Gothic style, which I would not have a clue what that actually means because I'm reading it straight off Wikipedia. But it is one of the main reasons why this town or this city became a uh, uh, UNESCO World Heritage Site. Here with my lovely host and I, Elga, Elga, Agla. Agla. <laughs> I looked at her name on um, on Couchsurfing and I'm like, oh man, I'm not gonna be able to pronounce it. People up calling me Ag Eagle. Ag Eagle, yeah. Anyway, so my time here has come to an end. I just wanted to thank you very much for hosting me. You've been an amazing host, and thank you for um, sharing stories, sharing stories with each other, and thank you for listening to my story as well. It's much appreciated. Yes much appreciated I don't have much for you but I do have a, just a small memento it's me and Kepi again and a note at the back I just want to say thank you it's just a small token of my appreciation uh, we got to talk and uh, converse a, a bit about um, each other's lives and sharing stories about traveling and um, and sharing my story about uh, uh, bringing awareness to uh, some of the difficulties that the parents the parents face, separated parents face, so um, I'm glad, I'm glad I got to share that with her and um, yeah, yeah, it was, it was nice. Anyway, that's it for me guys, all the best, take care, ciao, bye.